Hey, what's up and welcome to my tutorial on how to set up MusicBot in TeamSpeak using Spotify and a program yeah, called a Virtual Audio Cable. So first thing we're going to do, we're going to install a program called, called Equalify. Um, you can click Run, go through the, uh, the setup process, click Next, and all that. It says this, it says Modify, Repair, and Remove for me because I've already installed it. So since I have, I'm gonna click cancel. Since it's already installed, okay. And after that, there's another program you need to download from below called Virtual Audio Cable. Uh, it's shortened down to VAC when you download it. And you click, and once it's downloaded, you extract the files somewhere on your computer. And then you're gonna see a uh, setup. And you can go run the setup. Uh, what would you like to, uh, yes. Just click yes. It says it's for me. We get already installed. To continue, yes, I accept. Click install. I've already installed it, so I'm not going to. And then, so click install. It'll take a minute or two to install, maybe. You don't need to restart. Really easy. Okay. So once you have those installed, to check to see uh, if they're installed correctly, uh, right click in the bottom right hand corner. Right click the little audio, the little audio speaker thing, and click playback devices. And then once you do that, uh, in the playback, you should see something called uh, Line 1 Virtual Audio Cable. See that? You're good. All right, so next thing we're going to do is we're going to open, open up Spotify. So we have Virtual Audio Cable and Equalify installed. So here's Spotify. I'm going to be using a song from Approaching Nirvana because they don't claim copyright on their songs. All right, to tell if you've installed Equal to tell if it qualifies installed correctly, click, click play on a song, and then up here near the search bar, you'll see something called EQ. What you want to do is click that. All right. So now we can see this has popped up. What you want to do is right click uh, somewhere here, go to options, and then click change sound device. Once you've done that, you want to click this and select virtual audio cable and click set new output device. So now that this list will pop up, and you click OK, and then let's exit Spotify. All right, next thing we need to do is set up TeamSpeak. OK, so here's TeamSpeak. Let me connect to a server that I use a lot. OK, so this is the server I'm going to use uh, for this tutorial. Let me just go ahead and mute the mic in here. Muted. OK. So, um, let's see. First thing we need to do is go to settings and options. All right, now that we're in here, actually, no, yes, now it's fine. Now that we're in here, you're going to click a little, the little plus sign here, and let's make a new name for this profile. This cash book MB for music bot, and then voice activation detection. Set it down to minus 50 and click apply. Get rid of automatic gain and background noise, click apply. Also make sure that you do line one. Uh, and under capture device, make sure it's line one uh, for virtual audio cable. You need that, you're done there. Go to playback, same thing, MP. Um, okay, let's turn down these because you do not want to hear the other people twice. You don't want to hear like two people at the same time. And also the playback device, let's set it to virtual audio cable. And yeah, make it quiet. You can click apply. And once you're done with that, load the firmware here. You got them all good. MB, all the way down, voice activation, detection, playback for MB, virtual audio cable, all the way down. And then click OK. Now, as you're doing that, you're going to want to go to um, settings again. and I'm going to click Identities. All right, now we're here. We want to make a new identity. Let's call it Music. Let's call it MB again. And then the nickname will be Top Music. That's the name of the bot that every time it joins a server with uh, the identity MB. And we're going to click OK. All right, so now let's go to Bookmarks, Manage Bookmarks. Let's make a new bookmark. So. Let's uh, create a new bookmark. So let's make this server uh, 
and let's go to ts server mb. Let's say it's that. And then we add the address. I'll take this one. Okay, we'll put it there. Uh, identity mb. Capture profile mb. Playbook pro playback profile mb. And then that's it. And then we're going to click apply. Apply or OK. Now that that's done, you want to go up to Music Bot and click, right click, TS Server MB and click Connect in New Tab. Now that that's done, what you're going to want to do is open up Spotify, like so. Now, from before, remember when we changed the sound device on Spotify. So with this being, so let's play. All right, and let's turn up the volume. And now if you notice in the back, music top music now is lit up and if I pause music stops completely play music's there now also something you can do in TeamSpeak to make the to make the quality of the music sound better Let's turn that up a bit more let's get a bit more music to make the quality of the sound better if you're an admin or you can also ask always ask an admin is go edit a channel in TeamSpeak go to audio and click music Otherwise, it'll sound a bit channel edited, a bit tinny or something. But if you change it to music, channel edited, and you get the you get a full like a bit more bass in there or something, which sounds a lot better. Click OK uh, to, when you want to edit the channel, so then better quality. And that's about it. You know, you can give it some server groups or something like uh, guest or uh, lieutenant. Let's make it lieutenant music bot. <laughs> and that's it. You have your music bot in TeamSpeak 3 using Spotify. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you enjoyed. Any questions or any problems you have, leave it in the comments below and I'll help you out. Thanks a lot, guys.